The city of Struthers experienced a tragedy almost one year ago. The death of four year old Rowan Sweeney left many in the valley heartbroken over a senseless loss of life. For the past year, his father has been raising money to build a playground in his honor. First News reporter Hannah Erdman caught up with the father about the last year and how much closer they are to reaching their goals. He's not forgotten. We all remember him. He's loved and cared by so many. Almost a year ago, the Valley woke up to the tragic news that a young four-year-old boy had been shot and killed. Early morning on September 21st, a mass shooting sent two men and two women to the hospital and killed Rowan Sweeney. The young boy died in his mother's arms. The tragedy struck everyone in Struthers, and that heartbreak spread to other communities. Uh, being moms and dads, and you know, it's it's just it really hits home that things like this could happen to anyone. For the last year, Rowan's dad has been doing everything he can to keep the memory of his son alive. He has been raising money to build a memorial park in Rowan's honor. The community has been nothing but supportive. You know, there are people that I just I always have to go to when I'm feeling down, or when I'm feeling depressed about everything. I, I just to see other people, you know, support and care about Rowan. You know, it, makes me feel some type of way too. Today, they hosted a cornhole tournament. Sweeney says they are close to announcing an official location of the playground. On Tuesday, there will be a candlelight vigil to honor Rowan's life one year after the tragedy. Reporting Hannah Erdman, WKBN 27 First News.